What's up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Darian is Fishing. Today, I'm doing a $20 tackle store challenge. Basically, I'm at Gunnersville Tackle in Gunnersville, Alabama, the, probably the best tackle store in town. Definitely the best tackle store in town. And I'm gonna limit myself $20 to go figure out how to catch fish today out on Lake Gunnersville. And uh, pretty excited about this, so let's see how it goes. What's up? Morning. Morning. Look at here. Coming in. We're up early filming. All right. Twenty dollars. There's so much stuff here. I don't really know. You can go a bunch of different angles. You can go. You can go definite. Get you a TRD worm. Get you a net head. Do it. Do a twenty dollars worth of net heads, and you definitely probably catch some fish. That'd be too easy. I've been seeing some fish kind of, kind of busting on top. Not necessarily school not great, but. I haven't been schooling, so I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with one pack of Zoom flukes. That's four dollars. I feel like that's a good spin. I feel like that's a good spin on money right now. I got an idea. We're on Gunnersville. There's a specific bite that goes down at Gunnersville that uh, I want to be a part of today, but I don't know if I'm biting it. I just know that I've seen some fish. Hmm. I've got hooks, so I'm not gonna count just regular hooks. Lock and popper would work good, but that would spend the rest of the money. Huh. Twenty bucks. This buzzbait's legit, it's only ten bucks. Could get that. Firecracker's legit. Bunch of frogs. I think what I'm gonna go with is a pack of flukes and a chatterbait. I have the I'll have the flukes rigged wheat like just weightless and one chatterbait. Could get the uh, jackhammer. I love the jackhammer, but not today. This is a little expensive for my challenge today. Oh, the regular ones are cheap. Regular ones are super cheap. I'm gonna go with a half ounce chatterbait elite, not the jackhammer. I've been throwing the jackhammer a bunch. Mostly I've been throwing the jackhammer, but not with my $20 challenge, I don't want to use it all up on one bait. So, so far, got a pack of flukes and one chatterbait. So that's going to put me somewhere in the ballpark of uh, about $11. So we got a flukes, we got a chatterbait. All right, here's another worm. This is a new worm by Zoom called a Z-Crawl worm. So it's, a, it's like a mag finesse worm with a Z-Crawl tail. And I really like that. So I'm gonna get a pack of those in red bug. I'll show you that when we get out to the boat. All right, so I got two packs of worms, chatterbait. Oh, maybe that might be it. I'm getting out of this cheap. I might even be able to get, get myself a drink with my 20 bucks. <laughs> All right, so my $20 got me a pack of Zoom flukes, a new Zoom worm, chatterbait, and a Dr. Pepper. And uh, pretty excited, honestly. This is the first, uh, one of the first cool mornings we've had. Oh, in Alabama, it's normally about 95 degrees right now at uh, 6.15 a.m. But this morning is uh, a little bit chilly. I got a hoodie on, probably gonna, I mean, once I get done with my first run, I'll probably take it off, but I just wanted to see if I can catch a fish on $20 worth of tackle from the tackle store. So if you have faith in me, give this video a thumbs up. Hopefully I'll be able to, but as for now, I'm gonna hop off the camera, focus on driving, and I'll see you guys out there on the lake. We have made it out here to the lake. I'm ready to start my $20 tackle box challenge or $20 tackle store challenge. Here's the tackle that I got. Z-Man Chatterbait, Zoom Flukes, and this new worm by Zoom, which is, looks like that. Basically it's a mag finesse worm with the Zoom Z-Crawl trailer tails on it. I've never even, Never thrown it, never seen it. I just saw they released it, so that's why I got it. Probably catch some on it, but anyhow, gonna be fishing some humps today, some eelgrass, some hydrilla, and try to put a pattern together, catch some fish, 
Got a few hours to go fishing today before. Got to head back to the house, get some honeydews done, and um, hang out with Hannah and Coco. But anyhow, hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button. And uh, yeah, without further ado, I will jump into this video for you guys. All right, so I'm gonna rig up this uh, new Z crawl worm on a Texas rig. I bet this worm is gonna be really good on a Carolina rig as well, but not today, maybe one day. As all of you know, I like to do a Palomar knot on pretty much everything. If I use braid, I use a double Palomar knot, like a frog or punching. I will put this uh, zoom fluke on the back of the chatterbait as a trailer. So I got the half ounce chatterbait that way. I knew it was a little windy today, and the way I'm going to be fishing this chatterbait is a little bit deeper on this grass, so I wanted to get a half ounce. little one first cast right here not a bad start first cast on this spot I'll weigh it since everybody wants me to start weighing my fish I'm gonna guess it weighs 1.28 guess 1.36 little guy let him go get back after another one there's a better one Sound better, but he is definitely a little bit better. We might have us a two and a quarter on the chatterbait with the fluke trailer. Power on, reset. I will guess 2.36. Uh-oh. 2.76. Almost a three pounder. Nice chunk. I'm liking this. There's a good one. That might be that exact same 136 I caught earlier. Uh-oh. One nine two. Good 
Good little chunker. They're digging this chatterbait right this morning. God, it's got wrecked. Might come back and try to get it. God, I just got wrecked again. God, that fish freaking hit it and took off. Ow. There we go. I've already completed the challenge for the morning, the tackle store challenge. Hey, that's a pretty good idea right there. Good thinking, Ranger. Let's see if this one weighs. I want to say 2.15. So, got a bunch around that two pound mark today so far. Dude, that's a good that's a good rod holder right there to be honest so this is officially the most fish i've caught in a day here in a long time which is very sad because i think i'm at four God, came off. That one was the biggest one yet. They're crushing this thing, man. Ah, I told you. I'm not going to weigh this one. He's the smallest one we've caught yet. Not a bad little chunk though. Maybe a pound and a half. Maybe a pound and a half. There's a bigger one. No, it ain't either. He just crushed it hard. Oh. Another pound and a half. That's going to wrap up another episode of Darien is Fishing. And I'm not even going to keep talking. I'm just going to ask you, please go click down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell. I haven't, I've never asked anyone to do that, but the notification bell for any YouTuber that you enjoy watching their videos helps not only you, but it also helps them. It helps you notice 
and get notified every time they make another YouTube video. Um, and it helps them because that's what helps this video get seen to more people. Um, YouTube notices those things. So just wanted to ask that from you. All of the rod and reel setups that I use today will be listed down below as well as discount codes to get anything at Quantum for 25% off, six cents for 10% off, TH Marine for 15% off. So hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, I will see you on the next one.